morning, it's Susan and welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to make over the living room and give it a refresh. I love the green, but I thought I would try some blue. So come along with me and watch the process. So as you know, this is the color of my living room now. And I'll just give you a quick reminder of what it looks like. And you guys can let me know if you like the green or the blue better. So we're going to start with a blank canvas. Add this throw I got at home since. It's not easy to find anything anymore. Everything's kind of sold out. And I'm going to use the same pillows that I The problem with these couches are, because there's a seam in the middle, I kind of have to disguise this section right here. If it was a brand new firm couch, it would be a different story. I love the look of sectionals when you have, you know, a bigger pillow, a smaller pillow, and then another little accent pillow. But my couch isn't, even though it is deep, but these cushions take over. Two blue pillows with this kind of design. And we are just going to pop them over here. I guess I could have found a pillow that had a pattern to it, but I like a lot of fresh white. So I'm just going to leave the white pillow. I'm going to give it a little chop in between. Not all of them, just the three of them. Going to turn the camera around and start on the love seat. Okay, so then I got this other blue throw and I'm going to, this one has a tassel. Let's see if I can show the tassel. Yeah. I also, everything that you're going to see here, I think was from HomeSense. And I love these comfy cushions. They're very cottagey looking with the ruffle. So I'm going to keep these on here. And I found this cute little pillow, very soft, like a velveteen and it's got your pattern with blue, very neutral colors. So I'm going to pop that in the middle and just leave it like that. And then this blue gray, it, it's not exactly this color, but I didn't want it too dark, but here's the shadowing of the light blue gray. So, and to the little settee here, I'm going to just add another little pillow just to give it a little bit of blue. Trust. Like I said, it's kind of difficult to find a lot of blue right now. Everything's going to fall. Look at this unique candle that I found at Home Sense. I'm just going to place it over here on this little tray. So I've taken the decor off that I had there before, and I'm going to add this large, taller blue vase. And then I'm going to pair it with this pretty white vase with a little, little hobnob look. shelf, I'm just going to add this little basket, this little box, and I'm going to leave everything the same because I like to keep my pictures of my family. Then the next shelf, just add a little bit of gold with a candle. So that's it for that side of the wall unit. So for this side, all I did was take a few glasses off and then I'm going to add some blue wine glasses just to give it a pop of blue on this side. You can change up your color theme 
pretty inexpensively. What I did was I put the, the blue wine glasses and then I kept the gold so that there's gold on both sides. And that's it. I'm not changing anything else on that side. So for this little unit here, I have um, left the pictures. I've left most of it because I have a lot of white and neutral there. So all I'm going to do is add a book that's kind of bluish gray. So a little pop of coastal. I bought this cute starfish at Tone Sense, and I'm just going to place it on an angle so you still see a little bit of the blue. a little wooden bowl here and I'm just adding a little white bowl. So on the sofa table I have this sort of a creamy neutral colored dough bowl and I'm just going to add these three balls. Oops, they're really pretty. They're very textured. Okay, so beside the dough bowl, I'm going to place these two books. I'm going to beautiful vase that I got at Home Sense. I love the colors, the blue. It fades into a lighter blue with some creamy neutral. Putting the books makes it look, you know, more appealing, but it also gives it some height. And I'm going to add this little simple modern vase right beside it in front of it. Full hydrangeas to this pot. And now for the coffee table, I'm going to leave it the same. I'm going to leave this little beach mat on it. I'm going to put the basket back with the books. I found this gorgeous candle in this beautiful glass bowl. Look at this gorgeous blue vase. I'm going to Put this over here. Found this really nice white bowl in the kitchen section at Home Sense. And I found these beads. I'm going to just place them inside. And then just let a little bit of them droop over. Maybe like that would be nicer. Yeah. I got another candle in a different size. And I'm just going to place that over here just to give it a little bit of blue, fresh coastal feeling.
So thanks a lot for joining me today, friends. I hope you liked my blue coastal theme that I created today. So let me leave me a comment down below and let me know if you like the sage green or the blue better for summer. So I want to thank you again for all the beautiful comments that you've left me. It means the world to me and we will see you in the next video. Bye for now, friends.